Oscar voters are still making up their minds, but the British have spoken. 12 Years a Slave won the Best Picture BAFTA tonight. That is the British equivalent of the Academy Awards. Kate Blanchett won Best Actress for Blue Jasmine. Alfonso Cuaron was Best Director for Gravity. While we wait for the Oscars, it was curtained up this weekend on another big show in Los Angeles with a downtown construction site as the stage. Bill Whitaker saved us a front row seat. This is L.A.'s version of the Concrete Truck Ballet. Perhaps only in Hollywood can a grand production be made out of wet cement. It seems like a whole lot of hype for a bunch of concrete being poured, but then again, L.A. is a city built on hype. For example... Los Angeles will be one of the greatest cities on planet Earth, period, when this project is done. This project is a 73-story skyscraper called the Wilshire Grand, which, when it's completed in 2017, will be the tallest building west of the Mississippi, a bit taller than the Eiffel Tower, shorter than One World Trade Center, puny by comparison to the Burj Khalifa Tower in Dubai, the world's largest. So, if you can't break that record, perhaps the next best thing set a world record for the longest continuous pour of concrete. 21,000. 200 cubic yards, which is a new Guinness World Records title. Congratulations. Yes, today, right here, that record was broken, complete with recognition by Guinness. 18 and a half hours of uninterrupted concrete. That's certainly something to get hyped up about. Speaking of which... Think of the pyramids. Think of the great castles in Europe. Think of the cathedrals that draw your eye to the heavens. This is that kind of building. That building might still be a big hole in the ground, but for now, they have a record set in stone. Bill Whitaker, CBS News, Los Angeles.